question uh, B2 given that uh, we we did everything here so this is uh, what we where we left uh, everything from so uh, given that OC 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 is equal to H times OX okay show that CQ uh, CQ is equals to like that okay 4 times 1 minus h over 3 times q minus right so the question says um we have to show that oc um show that cq is equal to this all right so let's try to show um we we'll have to get rid of uh, this here so that you can try to make some space okay right and yeah we have so first of all we ask ourselves how do you find cq so cq will be cq which is all right so cq is this one here then all right so cq will be uh, let's see we have to how do you get uh cq okay so let's just say first of all that um cq cq is equals to this will be equal to co plus okay that is co plus o q again OQ. You look at this thing here, this diagram is very important to help you to be able to control. So how, how am I coming up with this? I know because if I start from here, come here, then I go there. My shortcut is just CQ. So for me to find CQ, I'll add this plus that, which is CO plus OQ. Now I have to ask myself then, um, what is my CO? So your CO is this one to there, but the question is, do we have the CO in this? So actually, uh, they've, they've given us OC. So another way in which you can put this, you can also say, it doesn't matter which, which, which way you use, but you can also say, um, when I add, O Q plus you can say when I add uh, let's just say O C plus C Q I will get O Q doesn't matter whichever way as long as you uh, you're making sense okay so you can say when I add O C that is O C plus that is O C plus C Q plus C Q I think this could be much easier but it should give me O Q uh, this should be plus not 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 uh, nickel sign okay. so which is O C plus not the nickel sign plus C Q it should give me O Q. It should give me O Q. Okay. So O C plus C Q should give me O Q. Uh, now, the question you have to ask ourselves: Okay, we can even use this one if you want, but probably in this situation, it would be best to use this one because we already have O C there. In here, we we'll have to change OC to CO which means we have to add a negative to OC so to make our life easier we'll just go with this so OC is equals to H times OX meaning H times what is OX this is our OX so we're going to multiply this OX times H okay so it will be H times everything okay here so just say h times 
4 over or we'll just put it as 4 h over 3 times this q here plus p as for oc plus cq what is cq uh, which is what we don't know okay plus cq this should give us oq what is oq oq is this for the q so for q there so first find cq we just have to take this uh the other side right we're just going to create space space for this one and do it on the other side okay so we're just going to say i'm just going to say so our c q is going to be for uh, this q vector there minus 4 h over 3 times this q plus p now we have to make uh, this q on one side okay so we say uh, this will become 4q minus this multiplied by this it will be uh, 4h over 3q plus th this will be minus plus 4h times p 4hp over 3 so we can collect the like terms together that is this one and that one so this will be we can uh, using algebra factorization can factorize four out what else q as well out and then we're going to have here one minus this is uh one times q we shall put q over three okay close and then we're going to say plus for h p over 3 okay so this is going to be our c q let us check if this is uh, the same as what we are trying to prove okay so we have 4 q 1 minus q 3 so let us just copy this one and bring it there Okay, so here we have it. Um, let's just check. Um, so is our CQ equal to 4, 1 minus H3? Okay, so. Alright, so we kind of missed something here. This 4Q and this one we factorized shouldn't be in here. It shouldn't be there. Okay, so and we, re we left our H there. Okay. So that's good when checking you know what you did wrong so this is what we did wrong uh, we input our h when you factorize 4q here you have you remain with one and then here you remain with uh you remain with one and then you remain with h so we have an h here okay we left that out so we have got one minus h over three then multiply by q which is this q here plus here we have 4 h p over 3 now this is again uh minus not 4 times uh this one is supposed to be minus and not a plus okay a couple mistakes in this question yeah so this is a minus okay so 4 uh negative 4 h over 3 times p should be negative 4 hp okay over 3 not plus All right so that will end up like this so this will be our uh showing that this is the way it is okay so again let me just go through it I'll do a couple of mistakes in this question that i did so i can say cq is equals to uh 
we multiply this comes here becomes negative we have 4 q here so you're going to multiply negative 4 h over 3 times q you have negative 4 h over 3 q then negative 4 h over 3 times p you have a negative again here. you have a negative again here and then factorize this q here you have 4 q you have uh, an h here remaining which is this one here I'll, I'll highlight this in red so that we know it will be h which is this h here over 3 then this is minus 4 hp over 3 and that will give us this one okay hope we're together here so that will be our answer it's correct uh, the five marks so you have to do carefully